destroys a building housing several businesses and apartments in Pulaski. Several departments responded and kept the fire from spreading to neighboring buildings. Kristen Allen is live in Pulaski this morning. Kristen, what new information have you? I just spoke with the fire chief a short time ago who confirms that the fire was started by a tree being cut down and it fell on electrical wires which sparked the fire. And you can see what's left of the building here behind me. It's basically just a big pile of debris and rubble. You can see part of the charred uh, frame of the building here and then up above it there are the lines back there and you can see the trees behind the building as well. So that's where a tree was being cut down that ultimately fell on lines that sparked this fire. The two businesses destroyed are a cut above hair salon and LeCount auctions. LeCount auctions posting on its Facebook page overnight saying in part quote the building we are in was completely engulfed roof collapsed and we have lost everything. We are praying for all those who lost their businesses and homes. The fire chief says the fire started on the upper level of the building and then traveled down to the first floor. About 20 fire departments rotated crews in and out of the fire in and out to fight the fire. They were able to keep the fire from spreading to those neighboring buildings and businesses. The fire chief says there are a lot of risks involved when cutting down trees. It's very dangerous, you know, even skilled professionals. Uh, trees once fall different areas. This one was very close to the power lines and it was a tough cut. So it, it had issues and, you know, it's a, it's a tough situation. No one was injured in the fire. Everyone who lived in the apartment units was safely evacuated. The next step is for this, uh, this pile of rubble and debris to be cleaned up here behind me. The city will be working with the business owners to be able to do that. Reporting live in Pulaski, Kristen Allen, Action 2 News.